Yo, what's poppin' people? Welcome back. <laughs> is it on? Is it on? I, know. I think it's in my teeth. <laughs> it is literally all over your face. Did it look cool? <laughs> <laughs> it's in your teeth. Oh my god. Welcome back to another video. Today we're gonna be doing the one view one top water only fishing challenge today. And I'm actually going up against Tara. We're gonna do the 1v1 challenge. Biggest fish wins. So it's not gonna be like a five fish or a three fish. Biggest fish wins, but we only throw top waters today. So that's the game plan. Also, it is the 4th of July. So this is kind of like a little 4th of July, red, white, and blue edition video. And she bought like this little popper. And I guess we thought it was like confetti. And it, it was like, it was what? It was powder and it got all over here, but. Straight blue. I look better now. Look, there's a little bit there. It was like all in her teeth and everything. That's hilarious. Well, we're gonna go ahead and hop into this, dunk the boat in the water and see if we can catch some really big fish today. It is really windy, so I do apologize about that in advance. Hopefully it won't be too bad on the cameras, but let's go ahead and get this started. If you guys are new to the channel, hit that subscribe button, hit the notification bell. Also hit the like button. If you guys wanna see some more 1v1 challenges with Tara, let me know in the comment section down below. Let's get after it. All right, y'all, let's get today started. I'm hoping they're gonna bite. Last time I was here, I didn't get to post the video, but caught almost 80 fish on a swim bait. So we're about to see what's gonna happen. I hope we're just gonna slam them on top water. You're good. By the way, I hope you guys like the American flag too. You know, we're all about that red, white, and blue here on Kicking Their Bass. We got some new merch dropping very soon. Um, some America themed, some US themed merch. So stay on the lookout for that. Good? I'm good. I'm gonna kick your butt today. Better watch what you wish for, girl. Honestly, I want you to beat me today. But I don't think I can let you. All right, y'all. Just got out to the first spot. I'm going to be starting off with the Mock Patroller. And this is by Mock Baits. If you guys want to check them out, you can find them on mock-nation.com or you can get them at Dick's Sporting Goods. I have the link down below. And the Kicking Their Bass combos, if you guys want to check these out, only available on kickingtheirbass.com. I have the link down below as well. Um, thank you guys, everyone who's supported me with Kicking Their Bass as far as the combos, Kicking Their Bass X Loose combos go. I really appreciate all y'all. But we're gonna get this started. Um, we're gonna be fishing this deep grass line out here. We're sitting in about 14 to 15 foot, and there's a bunch of thick hydrilla up here. So we're gonna start off here with these plopper style baits and see if we can get some fish to come up. I'm praying that they're gonna eat top waters today, guys. It is a little bit later, 11 o'clock right now. We wanted to get out a little bit earlier, but it, it did start raining, so. But it might rain here in a little bit, so we're really gonna have to hustle to catch these fish today. Well, let's see what we can do. Whoever catches the biggest one wins. So guys, the patroller that I'm using is actually all chrome. The one that Tara's using, let me see what you got. This one's like, I don't even know the name of this color, but it's got like a blue top and a white and chrome belly. So that one looks pretty good too. Are you ready? I'm ready. I am ready. I just ready. hope that they're gonna bite it. I'm praying that they're gonna eat it. Eat the old top water. With how many fish I caught here last time I was here, guys, I would be just mind blown if we don't end up catching them on this top water. But I don't know. We'll see. I will say the one thing I have seen on the graph is that the bait is, is uh, a lot deeper than I would like it to be. You know, when you're throwing a top water or jerk bait or something at the top of the water column, you kind of want that bait to be pushed up towards the top and Right now it's not, so. Maybe we do need to go in shallower. That was the first cast up shallower. Oh my God. <laughs> oh 
on the patroller. That was right as he threw it in. That was a nice one. Yeah, he hit it right when I threw it in. Okay. Maybe we'll, yeah. maybe we'll get a few on top of him. That's a good one. He's not quite three, but he's almost three pounds. He got a big head on he him. He said it too. And I was like, maybe we need to go up shower. Sure enough, he slammed it. Maybe that's what we need to do. He dove over it like a freaking five pounder. I'm not gonna lie, I saw his big head. I thought he was bigger. Here's our first topwater bass of the day. You wanna put him in the live wall? We'll get a picture. That's a good one. Two and a half. Can I get it? Hey. Hey, That's not a bad one. No, we'll call him two and a half. I'm, I think he's a little over that, but we'll just call him two. Two and a half. I'm on board now, girls. Your turn. Maybe they'll eat it. I'm just glad to see one bite. Oh, I got one. You got one? Yeah. Oh, nice. You got one way out there. There you go, girl. It honestly looks, it, it might be a little smaller than the one I caught. Yeah. Might be just a little bit smaller. Get it, girl. Oh, barely hooked him. Oh, yeah, you it's got him under the mouth, on. too. Here, I'll get it for you. Nice. You can choke it. He's not bigger than mine. No, he's not bigger than yours. <laughs> Good job. Yay, thank you. Now you're on board. We both got one. Yeah, let's go. Nice. I got a fish. <laughs> that was good. Now, you caught him on the outer grass patch, too. You caught him out here, didn't you? Yeah, first throw. Maybe we're fishing a little too close. That's a big one. <laughs> I'm gonna coast him in. His mouth's huge. His mouth is gigantic. Why did why do he look so big? Did he not? No, the mouth looks so big. I mean the mouth is big on him, maybe that's why. I mean it's a solid two pounder, but he looked four pounds. Yeah. Dang. There's our second fish. Yeah, he, he destroyed it. It sounded huge. There we go, guys. Third fish of the day on the patroller. I've caught two. Tara's got one. Nothing really giant yet, but this one, I don't think is as big as my last one either. I think my first one was bigger. See, they got big heads and small bodies. Still like a two pounder. Yeah. Yeah. Nice girl. I will say he's not big, but he, uh, he destroyed it. Man. That was crazy. I got him on top of the head. He ate me way out here. Gosh. You're pretty close to That was a bite. Did you hear that? Yeah. His hooks are good too, guys. That's one thing about the mock baits. Really great hooks on them. That's a smaller one. That was just about a pound. I'll throw him back. Nice. We got four fish total. That ain't too bad, right? Been out here for what? 30, 40, 30, 40 minutes, yeah. four fish on top water, not too bad. I don't know if you guys can see in the distance, the rain is not looking good, guys. It's looking a little, looking a little scary. Y'all, we got rained out, so we're going, <laughs> we're going back out now. Um, we, we literally parked the boat at the ramp, and just ran up in the car for like the last, what, 30 minutes yeah. maybe? Um, and it actually just stopped rain. I mean, it's slight sprinkle. It's fine though. So we're gonna go out and try to play around for a little bit longer. Um, I'm glad we caught the fish that we have. You know, we've caught like four fish already, so that's sweet. But we're gonna go out here for a little bit longer and uh, see what we can do. It is looking a little nasty, but maybe we'll be able to come out here for just a little bit. I had a big catastrophe happen too, which I'll show you. This uh, this literally broke. The, so we're kind of in a situation here. We had to like lay this down Look, to hold the out. water. Look, yeah, it did work. Oh, that's a big mess. All right, we'll see if uh, see we can go catch a couple. 
All right, guys, back at it. Are you ready? I'm ready. I'm so ready. All right, let's do it. Hey, maybe they'll bite really good. Sometimes they bite really good in the rain. I don't know how it is in Florida. We are on a Florida lake today, guys. Maybe they'll bite good. Maybe this rain turned them up. Either it turned it up or it turned them off. There's no in between. So <laughs> let's hope it turned them on and we can get on a few big ones real quick. That last bite we had. Oh, yeah. oh, that's the biggest one today. Okay, they might be biting really good. That was what, second cast, Tara? Yeah. Yeah, that might be bigger than any of them in the box. Woo! <laughs> nice. Get in there, girl. See, this one's actually filled out. He's a little thicker. I was just saying that last bite that we had was sweet, and then that one was kind of the same way. <laughs> Look at that, man. Maybe these fish are going to bite because of this rain. That's a good one. Y'all, that is a good sign. All right, Tara, it is your turn. Oh, no. Oh, I, thought I, I thought I reeled up my line in the trolling there. Oh. A bait that works really good in the rain is a buzz bait. And it's similar action to this bait. Like, it kind of kicks up water like that and that's like a bait that's just known to catch fish when it's raining outside like it's a great bait when there's water on the water so oh oh yes what's that oh it's a freaking that's the biggest one that's the biggest weird. one let's go get it girl get it. get it girl oh yeah oh yeah that's the biggest one can i help you yeah. Get it. Oh. Get yeah. Oh yeah. Yes, I needed him. I don't. Oh, they're they're so funny because their heads are so big. Yeah. And they're just like their bodies are so skinny. But I think he might be the biggest. If not, he tied the biggest. He's my biggest one today. Heck yeah. Good job, girl. Well, there's Tara's second fish of the day. Yeah, throw it back in there. See if you can get another one. That's a good one too. I can't, I don't know. I can't tell if he's the biggest or if he, he might be the, just the second biggest. Huh? Or I mean, uh, not second biggest, tied with the biggest. We just need to come in on the spot a little bit more. That's literally it. He missed it a couple times, didn't he? Yeah. We're gonna change up from the patroller to a Strike King Sexy Dog. If you guys wanna get a discount on any of the Strike King baits, I have a discount code and link down below. But the last time me and Tara went out topwater fishing, not on this lake, it was on a different one, but they were killing the sexy dog. Might be able to call up some bigger ones with that. So we're gonna try that. Cloudy out, that bone color. So you either wanna go with that black or white, or you wanna go with this. This is called bone. It's kinda like a, it's a white kind of tan. This bone color in the clouds, I mean, it's just, it's money. It's money. You don't want that reflection, you know. You, that chrome when the sun's out is, is killer. When them clouds get out, you get this darker color on more matte look they munch it I wasn't even watching it. <laughs> that scared me. There we go. First sexy dog bass, and surprisingly, it's smaller than anyone we caught today. I thought he was gonna be bigger. Look how fat he is, though. Yeah. He got a little belly on him. Pretty fish. Sexy dog bass. He destroyed it, though. 